Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the stage Wella Creative Ambassadors, Christopher and Sonia Dove. Excited to be here again. We love coming to Orlando. It's fantastic. So thank you to Wello and uh, Howard for having us back. And we're going to really show you some amazing things. So here we are, our first segment. And uh, I heard Mary ask, have you heard of Color ID? Well, this is our Color ID segment. So we're going to share a little bit about that uh, product with you. You know how they always say that hairdressing isn't rocket science? you know, and they kind of like try and downplay us hairdressers. Well, it's really becoming rocket science. The new technology that's come out is absolutely amazing. And now there's an additive to all the Weller permanent colors that you can actually keep the color completely separate on the same kind of strand of hair. So as Mary was saying, rather than having to use foils, we could use a level 12 next to a level three and them not blend together. It's amazing. I, you I come think that deserves a, oh, like, I'm just gonna say a level 12 next to a level three. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, um, Chris and I, we have a salon in Santa Monica, and if you come into the salon, you'll see that we're using uh, up to like five or six colors without foils. It's quick, it's creative, it's easy, and the big thing, it's so much fun. It really is. So I'd like to bring forward um, our first model. Uh -huh. And, and then if we could have the uh, before picture up as well, please, of the, uh, the actual sculpture we did. Yes. Um, Color ID, um, you see, kind of gives the consistency, a lot of uh, more of a thicker kind of feel. So as you're working with it and you're actually working it through, we're working with a spatula rather than a regular brush. And um, you're working with strands that you can then sculpt into a shape. So rather than everything yeah. just hanging down with foils, you can actually work into a kind of a sculptural looking shape. So of course, the clients that are around that see that happening are all asking, what's she getting done? You know, what's she having? Which starts the whole conversation about really kind of like what color ID is all about. Chris, a little bit more about the styling. Well, what I did with the hair is we actually worked in some of our new oil reflectives, and the oil reflectives is a really great moisturizing product. So I used it in the conditioner as well as some on her hair. Then I kind of let her hair air dry, and then used our kind of our, our really strong spray from our Karen styling range to actually kind of sculpt the hair into place. Almost using a French twist kind of thing, I used one twist through the middle, and then twisted the two sides up, and then brought the back, or the, sorry, the front, back and start sculpting the edges of it. And then the different tonality you're seeing on the ends is almost like a little trimming of hair. So it kind of like is a little kind of trimming that I edged the hair with just to kind of give it a design. So you can kind of see that um, it has this kind of almost um, an airy feel to it. We colored the base color permanently and then the edges have been kind of added. So it's just really for really being able to give you a more editorial kind of look and how you can kind of take a hairstyle and change it up. How'd you like it? Gorgeous. <laughs> Wonderful. And uh, Maria, this is Maria, and um, oh. we. Uh, She's got beautiful long hair, and what we did, we've used many colors, so I'll ask the uh, gentleman, the cameraman, to really come in, and we've used, uh, actually, uh, Melanie, may I have the picture, the uh, one that we just showed uh, earlier? Please, the one there that was twisted. There we it. are, fabulous, thanks. So this is uh, Maria's hair. We have six colors on her hair and no foil there. You can see all the dimension within the hair, the tones running through. We've got coppers, we've got reds, we've got even a two stroke zero, a level two, which is very dark. And you know, if you put a level two next to a copper or a red, they're going to like all mush together. With color ID, it kept all the tones separated. So we've got a level eight copper, we've got a level five intense red, we've got a almost a black, darkest brown. 
and everything was just applied with the hand and spatula with our color ID. And then as you could see in that picture, I just took each section and twisted it up. So she had almost like a, a turban look while it's developing. And what we found with Color ID in our salon is it's so visual, everybody says, oh, I want that, what's that? Because each hairdresser can just create any shapes they want with the color. So it can only be added to our permanent hair color within the Weller family. So that is Colliston Perfect and Illumina. And a little bit also, we have a new color that we're going to share with you. It can be added to that as well. We're going to be sharing later. But um, here, many tones, different shades, and it's just so much fun to blend all the colors together. Thank you, Maria. Shana, gorgeous. Now, um, on Shana's sculpture, what we did is she's got very fine hair. So with her hair, I tended to, you see that panel in the picture, if we could keep that picture up for a minute. That is the pre-lightened panel. So I pre-lightened a panel with blonde or powder lightener and then shampooed that off. Then I applied my other colors and I did a copper color at the new growth in that lightened panel, which was a level eight copper from Colliston Perfect, and that was mixed with 10 volume. And then through the mid lengths and ends, I used a blonde, a level nine blonde. So she's got copper going into blonde, and I just twisted them. So um, just bringing her hair forward here, you can see those tones open it. It's, we have, um, Actually, she's very tall. You are do tall. It? And I've got my highest heels on. There we are. But just um, because that's a great shot that for the actually, camera yeah. there. Um, we can there see a copper root area going into a blonde, just twisted like a piece of rope. No foil separation at all. And then the rest of the hair, I used a level six copper from um, scalp to ends. And I like just, as I do each section, I just twisted it. Sometimes I coil it, but uh, it really keeps the separation amazing and um, all done. And it's so quick in the salon, it really is. I want to say as well, the technology is called Invisi Divider Technology, which means it invisibly divides the two colors. So you can actually put them in a bowl next to each other and the two colors won't blend. You can't actually mix the two colors together once it has the color ID in it. That's how powerful it is. So when you are working with it on the head, you, um, you don't even kind of really get, the only thing I've ever seen is like if using a black and a blonde together, you get like a bruising of the two together, but it's not like if you put a black and a blonde together and you get that complete mix you would have, you know? So that, that is the greatest extreme you can kind of like really kind of see it. And um, obviously when we're doing blondes and we're using maybe three or four different shades of blondes, it's perfect to go for a seven, maybe a nine and maybe a 12 and working it all in together. Yes, and when you add the color ID, it makes the formula much thicker. It has a different weight. In fact, um, down at the Weller area, there's lots of demonstrations by Dana and Mark uh, from our Weller team, and they can go into really little detail about it, but it is something that really is- Really powerful, it's it really, really is. really, really powerful. Thank you, darling. Thank, Thank you. Thank you, my darling. That's it. So that's the one. Gorgeous. Now, our, our other model, now she's got one length hair, so I thought rather than do any internal colouring, I'm going to do colouring where it, I take the one strand, uh, one segment of hair colour and do different shades going down one length. So if we could have the sculpture for, this is my, yeah, Chris, I love food, as many of you know. Mm. and. Chris looked at that and he said, it looks like Cinnabons. I, I know, no, she always makes you. fun because when she's explaining colour and, you know, t talking to a client, she's always like, I'm going to give you a nice chocolate 
brown <laughs> and a little raspberry drizzle in there and then a little caramel highlight. And the clients are getting hungry just listening to the explanation. And then <laughs> another one she goes, it's a brown with a little bit of red in it. It's like a cherry Coke. It's lovely. Or, you know, and then she's explaining to the hairdresser. She goes, what we've done, we sandwiched the hair. Like, this is the bread and that's the bread. And then the middle one is the cheese. And you're like, well, you know, or a cheesecake section through the top. It's lovely. Everything's food. Everything but a birth sign is Taurus. And if any of you know Tauruses, it's driven by food. I a love lot of food. it is driven yes. by food. So Tauruses. Yes, yes, here for Taurus. <laughs> And so stubborn little buggers as well, let me no, tell you. Stubborn. No. Uh, 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 no. Just saying. <laughs> That's, yeah. yeah. That's Chris's version. <laughs> yeah, well. So here <laughs> on my model, <laughs> what I did, and you could see I twisted it up in circles. So I just separated the hair. I took each section. I made a nice little cine bun on top of her head to begin with. And that, that was a great <laughs> close-up. I'll ask my model just to put her hair back. So we've got a level, for all Colliston Perfect was used with colour ID. We've got a level five red from scalp to here. And then we have a level seven red, vibrant red. We have a level eight copper, and then the ends are a level eight copper mixed with 10 stroke zero. So it's progressively getting lighter. And I just took my spatula, applied, did the next color, and you can see just blended it, and then the next color and the next color. If you do come down to the booth area to look at the models closely, you'll see there is no lining. It's just a seamless blend of color. And I just twisted it, the hair up and did it in that little Cinnabon I'm going to do it thing. now. Like. And you see, she, oh, she's very tall, isn't she, this model? Um, yeah, it's a, it's a raspberry jam and a <laughs> okay. strawberry jam and a marmalade on the end. It's lovely, isn't it? It's yummy. <laughs> Can you imagine? You're all <laughs> laughing. You're all laughing. We've known each other since I was 12 and he was 14. Yeah, we've known That's each other how that long. long. So sometimes we don't even have to speak. He just like, Chris and I just look at each other and we just do it. You I know. know, sometimes we're in the model room. She's just about to open her mouth. I'm like, don't. And she's like, how do you know what I was going to say? I'm like, I know what you're going to say and don't. You know, it's like. <laughs> so um, I'd like to say thank you to our gorgeous model representing Colour ID. Yeah, there we go.